Hi, so a few people were asking about the pros and cons of attending UPenn, so I thought I'd just run through them real quick. First pro is definitely the social scene. It's a big school, but not too big, so you're going to be able to find a lot of people that you get along with, but you're not going to feel too overwhelmed. Secondly, the campus is beautiful. It's in the city, but not in the heart of the city, meaning that you have access to Philadelphia, but you still have that campus vibe, so it's really pretty, and it's really nice during the fall and spring. The pre-professional vibe could be a pro or a con, depending on who you are. It is very pre-professional in the sense that by freshman year, a lot of people have already got like internships, research positions, some people have even found a startup already. It's very fast paced, but it does help you in terms of like formulating your future. So it depends on kind of who you are. Another mixed one is Greek life. I personally think that Greek life at Penn is very, very open. Like everyone that I know of has found some sort of place in Greek life. There's pre-professional frats, there's uh, pro like social frats, there's community service frats, et cetera. There's a whole bunch. And I feel like uh, Greek life really is inclusive at Penn. And I think it is a really fun time. A con would be the mental health resources at Penn. Um, I know personally that it took me up to three months to even get an appointment to meet a therapist there. Um, and something called Pen Face that people talk about where people like really have a stigma about talking about their own mental health issues and they're falling behind in their work, etc. But people just pretend it doesn't exist. So that's a bit of an issue, but I feel like if you can get your own therapist or you can just do walk-in appointments at the therapy center, CAPS, it should be okay. A pro would definitely have to be academics, in my opinion. There's a whole range of classes from seminars to lectures, etc. And you can take them across all four schools, so the business school, the nursing school, the engineering school, the school of arts and sciences. And you just learn a whole bunch of different people, different inspiring professors, etc. Flexibility at Penn is amazing. You can really just learn anything you want. It's basically a liberal arts degree. Uh, you can also do dual degrees across the school. So even if you're in the College of Arts and Sciences, you can apply to do a dual degree in the School of Engineering, Warden, Nursing, etc. You can really learn anything you want to learn. And I think that's really, really great. The last pro, in my opinion, is the alumni connection because that is amazing. Like during homecoming, it's awesome just seeing everyone coming back. Uh, there's so many people you can reach out to for help, assistance, internship, etc. I think that's really, really cool that you have so many prominent leaders in the world who are like connected to you through the school. Lastly, there's a bit of elitism at Penn, sadly. Like there's a bit of um, a warden shadow. Like despite nursing being literally ranked number one in the country, it doesn't get that recognition. So that's in a nutshell. So if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. I'm here, uh, just shoot me a quick message.